Hey guys, it's Dr. Teriyaki here with another Let's Play of World of Warcraft. I actually got it right this time. Yeah, uh, last time we left off, we were about to kill Vagash at Amberstill Ranch. He's been killing the herd, and that is not alright. But, uh, yeah. How's it going, guys? Um, this episode, I finally got into, uh, my guild. Because nobody else was on, nobody was really on for a couple of days, it was weird. Well, no officers, at least, but yeah. So, we got that extra 10 or 20, whatever. I think it's 20, but I don't know. It might be 10, though. Either way, I got that extra experience bonus and a bunch of other guild perks. Level 18, so... But yeah. So, we killed Vagash. That was an extremely easy quest. We got uh, turn that in. Getting in some... I think I picked the most... best one to sell, and that was that one. Because I have the heirloom gear. But yeah. So now... We are going to get six stolen rams. Well, we had to recover them. And <laughs> this episode, uh... I don't know, I was having the hardest time spelling whistle. Like, should have just made a macro, but... Yeah, I spelled it like probably like a hundred times. I kept getting the last like three letters screwed up. <laughs> it was like right there, too. I just couldn't... I don't know. But yeah, I kind of had to look around what I was supposed to even do for this quest, because... I don't know, I was confused. I didn't read the entire quest text, but yeah. But again, like I said before, how's it going? I'm great. I'm in a terrific mood. Um, daylight savings time is awesome. But yeah. Pretty much. I haven't really been doing anything lately. I was uh, watching this little Wayne video. Not, no, Chris Brown. And it was very bizarre. I don't understand rap music. But yeah, so... I picked Enhancement as my spec in uh, this. But, like, I don't know. Like, Lightning Bolt does, like, 110 damage, like... Or not yet, later on, but... Either way, still... I don't know. I just It's hard to choose, like... It might do I want to be in hit? Oh, I guess I'm not even level 10 yet. I'm getting ahead of myself. Whoops. Um, yeah, though. So, yeah, I had to read the quest text here, like, oh, I'm supposed to whistle. And that's probably the best whistle noise in the world. I think that they made this quest to showcase that they have different whistles now, because I think they only had one before. They should have also had you been able to do the train one. Yeah, you see, I'm getting frustrated trying to spell whistle here, because I'm a loser. But yeah. <laughs> so, we did that. And, you know, we're getting there. We're slowly uh, finishing this quest. That is extremely hard, because I don't know how to spell whistle. Yeah. I think I'm going to play some Team Fortress 2 tonight. That should be fun. Normally on Team Fortress 2, I play as the medic, or, uh, uh, yeah, it's normally medic, scout, or engineer. Although I was playing as a, as a heavy in Arena, and, oh, no, I also played as Pyro for a bit. Yeah, I, I guess you could just say I play all of them. But, yeah, this bear comes out of nowhere, and I just pwn it. Yeah, Team Fortress 2 is awesome. I was like... I was owning as a pyro yesterday in arena. And they're like, don't camp. I wasn't camping. I was. I don't think you can even camp in a Team Fortress 2. But yeah, that game's so cool looking. I love the style and everything about it. Very cool. One thing, I think I said this before, is that totems in this game, they're extremely hard to use. Well, I just forget. I think maybe if I was in an instance or something, it'd be like, yeah, okay, I'll put them all down, but when you're running and, like, back and forth and you kill enemies in, like, two shots, it seems kind of pointless. So I don't use that. Um, but yeah. One thing that I notice is that as, like, our guild, uh, like, more people reach 85, less people, I mean, uh, the experience that we get for the guild goes down because people aren't really questing and they're just doing dailies or not even dailies they're just uh you know doing the daily uh, dungeon and that's it oh that's what I did on my warrior 
for a while, and I haven't really been playing her. <laughs> um, you know, this is way more fun right now. The shaman is ultimate fun. If that's even a word. Well, I guess that's two words. Yeah. I don't know. So, uh, the one thing I did today was I organized all my game informers. I just got the new one, which had Saints Row 3 on it. Or Saints Row the third. Um, <laughs> I played Saints Row 2, and that was an awesome game. Um, I don't know, I just loved, like, how, like, it seemed really, really long. And it was, because you had to do, like, all the strongholds and all the gang leaders. But yeah, man, that game was just so cool. And you're this, like, awesome black guy. Well, I guess you could pick for multiple people. I just picked a black guy because I felt, well, is that racist if I'm white and I picked a black guy? I don't know. Either way, he was an awesome person. See you soon. My, uh, my gang hideout was the coolest thing ever made. Yeah. So, yeah, we went to Grom, Goldballer, Cory, and, uh, we got these quests. And, uh, these quests were pretty fun, actually. I think I had, but the only bad thing is that, like, I had to end the video in the middle of, like, the quest, like, inside the cave. Or mine, rather. But, yeah, these quests are cool. But other than that, Watch your back. I really like doing this World of Warcraft stuff. It is fantastic. I feel like a new person every day. I uh, wake up and I'm like, I'm gonna make some videos today. And I even get a tear in my eye. Well, I don't. But, I don't know where I was going with that. But yeah. I'm loving life. Feeling good. It takes two to make everything go right. It takes two to make it out of sight. Rob Bass and DJ Easy Rock are the best people in the world. Okay, so we started these quest majiggers. Awesome. Um, there's a spider in my bathroom. And I am absolutely terrified of spiders, which is weird because, you know... I'm a 16-year-old guy, and I'm like, don't touch me, spiders. I don't, I can't even look at them. I'm a complete wuss when it comes to spiders. So. But other than that, that spider... Still up there. Never going back in there. Yeah. Um. <laughs> I posted up a... Was it... I think I posted Paul Juarez, Assassin's Creed, and what I'm gonna post this one up today. But, uh, Call Juarez is really fun just because, like, one thing I don't make it, like, better than 360p because it just uploads really fast and I don't know. It's awesome that I can just, like, go blah blah blah, produce and share, and then it's, like, kinda done and uploads in, like, 10 seconds. It's awesome. I love Call of War's Bound of Blood. It's like the worst game ever made, but at the same time, it's a first person shooter with the Civil War. Then you go to like Mexican Town, which I haven't actually gotten to yet in the Let's Play. But you go to Mexican Town, and it's like. You automatically, like. Is it Ray? Yeah, not Thomas. Ray is. Ray's like number one problem is that. He's attracted too much to women, and that's not alright. Oh, I, I just got a level 10 there. Got talents, and this is where I pick enhancement. Yeah. But, and I guess uh, you can dual wield, and this is where that sharp axe comes in handy that I got from Karnos. So that was awesome. But yeah. <sighs> I'm tired. And uh, as you can see, I'm uh, depositing one copper to the guild bank every time I'm really helping out my guild. Um, you know, you gotta, you just gotta do that.
giant contribution that I'm making. And, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I don't, I, that's one thing that I don't understand in this, uh, in this play is that when these, uh, trap miners are, like, trapped, and they look terrified. Like, you left click on them, and they're like, great to meet you. It's like, what? Why are you so happy? Like, uh, well, I guess it sort of makes sense, but their tone of voice is just completely wrong. Well, and I'll, that's even probably more weird. What's on your mind? Shouldn't I be asking, like, you like, are you okay? But instead you're going, what's on your mind? It is bizarre. <laughs> but yeah. So we're just saving all these miners, you know, right-clicking the enemies to attack them. If you don't know that, God, I hope so. Here there. But one thing I find myself doing is that <laughs> I record more than I put out, so like I'm getting a surplus of gameplay. Like, yeah, I have like seven episodes of like this, like saved up. And I have like two of Call of Juarez. And I have like ten of uh, Assassin's Creed, but like I play more than I put out. Which is fine. Oh yeah, I, I got a small blue pouch. And I was like, where did it go? But I guess it already uh, kind of put itself in there. Which is nice. But yeah. My output ratio to play ratio, or record ratio, is like bizarre. It's like play 22 and then it's like output 1. But yeah. Ugh. Minecraft and all that jazz. I want to put some of those videos up. I just don't know what to do in it. I also have like... I bought the orange box like a while ago. And I don't know. I'm thinking about doing Half-Life, Half-Life 2 and Half-Life well, isn't there Half-Life 2, Half-Life... Well, I have Half-Life 2, Half-Life Episode 1, Half-Life Episode 2, and then, like, Half-Life Lost Coast, which I don't but, yeah. even know what that is. Um, but, uh... Yeah, I'll probably... Get, uh... Yeah, but I'll probably put those up. Sorry about this weird audio thing, but I ran out of time. But, yeah, I'm Dr. Terry. Thanks for watching, guys. Subscribe, like, favorite, comment. Comment, really. It's awesome. But, yeah, alright, guys. Goodbye.